<laughs> yeah, and uh, we got some top oh, actually, players coming in. Oh, actually, look who's playing right now. Oh, we got Gohan, Gohan. and Who, Marco. Who's, Gohan is NorCal, so it's still Cali. It doesn't even count. <laughs> <laughs> so Chili Cheese is the only out-of-state player. We got player. Uh, uh, out-of-region people here, <laughs> not even out-of-state. Yeah, I mean, in, in Smash, SoCal and NorCal are considered like different regions. Yeah. But, you know, technically it's, it's not. But. All right, so we're in losers' mids here. Yo, and Marco. Ganon? What? <laughs> Yo, okay, okay, Gohan. I saw him use a Falcon earlier against Larry, but that Ganon, though. Yeah, and uh, especially in this matchup, Ganon hates fighting against projectiles, but oh my god. Ah! Oh, but he's getting in. That was like three hits. <laughs> three hits, he's at 71 already, All but right, these Ganon. bombs are pelleting him. Punishing those techs. Oh, oh, jab block. Okay, now you're okay, uh, able to get a forward smash. He goes for a forward tilt instead. Oh, okay. yeah, I forgot he had that uh, the animation switch on that. Yeah, I, I always forget about that, too. It always throws me off guard every time I see it. It's like, oh, yeah, it's, it's different. All oh, right. Confirmed. All right. Yeah. That was good confirmed. Good confirmed. <laughs> Looking like a pseudo young link out here. Oh, no. No, no yeah, double no jump. Double okay. Yeah, he had the bomb. That was good. Very nice using that bomb to get him into Zare positioning there. Yeah, and then punishing Zare is, like, so hard. Yeah, especially with Ganon. <laughs> yeah, you can't, you can't even go off stage. You can, like that. Yeah, but, but, oh, but the bomb. Oh, you living. Yeah, the bomb hit him at the last moment. Go oh, that's bomb. scary. Oh, I thought, I honestly thought he was going to Z-drop that bomb to get him. Yeah, that was scary for Gohan once, like, Marco made it back. But, uh, managed to survive a little bit longer. Oh, Z-drop against That's going to do it. Yeah. Okay. Gohan, I mean, only a 32% lead's not good for Marco. That's, like, one hit from Ganon, and it's even again. Yeah. So. It, oh, we're getting get something started. 32, that's good. Oh, yeah, you have him trapped at the ledge, too. So, yeah, even more percent. Yeah, and a lot of oof, a lot of what Ganon wants to do just beats out Dude, two links uh, projectiles. How did that bomb hit Marco? He threw it at him, and then he like, and then Gohan reflected it with like forward air or something. Like, that was weird. Like oh. Ganon does not obey the laws of this game, honestly. Okay, he, he probably made the bomb explode, and yeah, Marco he, was just too close. That looked weird. I thought I thought forward air was like a reflector for a second. I'm like, wait, what? Yeah, what I, I'm pretty sure it was just him. Oh, oh <laughs> using that bomb against you, kind of looking like this Mario is. Yeah, and, I mean. You know, even if you don't know any, even if you're not the best at items, one classic thing you can always go with is just d throwing it down into like any direction that they fly to, to left or right. Gohan being a little bit antsy with that up smash there. Not going to be able to catch him. He's on the ledge now. Marco has the up tilt, up air, no. Down tilt, going to go with Boomerang. Oh, doesn't have the fire arrow so he can catch him off. Yeah, this is scary because he has to finish off Ganon fast. Oh, he has to get in to do that. He's been at that percent for a whole long while. Uh, there it oh, goes. that's good. That's good. Okay, going deep. That was a weird angle from the nair because he didn't want to backside in there. Yeah. He got that kill though, you know. Yeah, whatever it takes. Last stock. But, I mean, Marco's def <laughs> Marco's at such a deficit right now. Oh yeah. That's oh it. god, my forehead hurts from that, bro. Yeah. Marco, I noticed in this game at least likes to uh, from the ledge like drop down and trying to go for like an offensive uh, yeah. attack but I think Gohan got onto that right there. Yeah, and Gohan's doing really well at uh, covering all of that off. All, all, most of his options with fair. He's facing it pretty precisely, catching him with neutral get up, with jump get up. And then if he wants to do drop down double jump, which I think he did at that last moment, got him with the fair as well. Yeah. So, good option coverage from Gohan there. Mm -hmm. We'll see if Marco can mix it up, because I feel like if Marco can play the projectile game correctly, this is definitely, I feel like it should be in his favor, but, oh, that's a punish. Oh, parry that boomerang, but. Yeah, we also have to uh, understand that we have three yeah. back airs. Yeah, get some back air trains on, for real. Yeah, and that, like, you were saying before that if he plays the projectile game really well, he, he should win this matchup. It's also due to the fact that Toon Link has such short range on him as well. Yeah, I can see that. So whenever he needs to get the kill, he kind of needs to be inside of Ganon's right, range. Right, right, yeah. That, that could be a problem. All right, no double jump kick. Oh, Gohan lands for free, doing, basically. Doing pretty good this uh, this stock so far, though. But, I mean, it's all about whoever gets that first stock. I would say, oh, wait, that's a, okay, that, that looked like it could have been it. I thought he was going to go for B reverse up B there. Definitely could have taken that stock there. Oh, just going, rolling around all these forward airs here. And I love what Gohan's doing with these up airs. When he connects them, he's using the weak hit to put Marco back into disadvantage state. Yeah. And, okay. Yeah. Oh, still living, though. Yeah, yeah you gotta snipe him. I like the reverse up beat there. Just covering just in case he was able to make it back. Mm -hmm. Bomb in hand. 
Uh, yeah, shield in just so it can go off on the enemy. If they were any other stage, I'm pretty sure that Tim Link would have died. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Marco likes it down here a lot, too. That I'm surprised that was the first time I've seen it so far, though. Um, I don't think he can afford to do it as yeah, much not, in this match. Not in this one. You get punished way too hard. Yeah, it's, especially when you do it on shield. Ganon can just get him back off some wall. Ooh, what Ooh. the heck? There's the down air again. Yeah, oh, no. yeah, you're getting punished it. for it. You're getting punished for it. Oh, it's wizard foot, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Ooh, no. Oh, the back that air. That was arc. so good from Gohan. He, he was patient at the ledge, got him in that tech chase scenario, and then got the read into a kill. That was so nice. Yeah, even in this matchup where he is being pelted by projectiles left and right, he's doing his really he's doing really well at being patient and waiting yeah. out all these projectiles. And, and then plays. like once he gets that opening, like he goes in, like right here. Oh god, he wanted that life right there. Gets the strong hit of up air and gets the tech. Gets the Oh they god. Both get a tech. Flame choke. Okay. Boomerang. I thought he was gonna do a back. Oh that's there. not good! That's it, yeah. <laughs> well, GG's. Good, good showing from Gohan, that Ganon. Definitely. It was scary.